start a new game? Yes. Hello. Hi. Jacoby is lost here, and this is The Elder Scrolls V Skyrim Special Edition on the Xbox One. No mods, just in case you're wondering, no mods. But that is why I am playing it on the Xbox, because I wanted, wanted to be able to get those them nude mods, you know? I'm just kidding. I don't play that. I don't, I don't, I don't I wouldn't do, I don't, I don't do that. Anyways, I'm starting a new game here. I know recently I played Skyrim on the Xbox 360 and I said I was going to go through that. Well, that fell apart, you know? That just, that just didn't happen because now after you see this game and you go back, it's just like, how, how am I going to do this? But uh, before we get too far into the uh, things here, I need to, hopefully they let me press start eventually. Oh, I'm sorry. I, w I, I got this wrong. I did I said it was the Elder Scrolls V. It, I forgot. It's the Elder Scrolls V. My bad. Hi there. It's Unicorn Dog. Okay, here we go. All right. So the reason why I press start is uh, I need to turn down some some things here. Music mainly because the music is loud as fuck. Along with oh, we'll just turn down the master volume just a bit. I know I don't have the volume up very loud on on the actual live stream but that you know that's okay that's fine not a big deal I forgot to clean my TV off oops hey you finally awake oh wait oh, wait hold on he's like hey you you finally awake subtitles there we go oh you can change the depth of field I like that we're going full depth of field. And in case you're wondering what depth of field is, it is where uh it's unicorn dog says Bethesda is Bay for Bay for Elder Scrolls Purple Heart. Anyways, depth of field is whenever, you know, like if something's in the foreground, the background if you're focusing on the foreground, the background will be blurred out. Or if you're looking at the background then the foreground will be blurry a bit, you know? That is depth of field. Say close these Empire, Empire wants. We're all brothers and sisters in binds now. Ain't that the truth? What's wrong with him, huh? Watch your tongue. You're speaking to Ulfric Stormcloak, the true high king. Oh, Yarl of Windhelm. You're, You're the, the leader of the rebellion. Captured you. Oh god. Where are they, Where are they taking us? us? This game looks so pretty. This can't be happening. This is like this. Hey, what village are you from, horse thief? Why do you care? A Nord's last thoughts. And it's so colorful too. I'm glad they they added more color to it because in the original it wasn't that colorful. Everything was pretty much white, brown, gray. I mean, yeah, there was green, but it, what I mean is, like, this looks more colorful. Are you still there, or are you just not saying anything? Oh. <laughs> nice. In case you're wondering why I said just cut off like that, if the stream was like, well, because I was, I was in a party with It's a Unicorn Dog, and I, I thought she was going to say something back, you know? I thought I was going to get some kind of reciprocation. But no. No, I didn't. <laughs> Cause I couldn't. All I can hear is the game. You weren't making any sounds. No sounds. You, you weren't making any barking noises or anything. Cause you're a dog. You get it. Yeah, you get it. You fucking bitch. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> I just realized that his house that he goes into there is the one you end up jumping into. Like his house is about to get fucked up. Let's go. Shouldn't keep the gods waiting for us. No, wait, we're not rebels. You're not gonna kill me. <laughs> You've got to tell them we weren't with 
with you. This is a mistake. This is a mistake. This horse is in the way. This is hilarious. What the fuck? This horse is just like standing here. Oh, this is great. <laughs> the horse just watched Ulfric walk by. Lokir of Rorikstead. You can't do this. You're not going to kill me? I love that he says that and just immediately dies. Anyone else feel like running? Wait. You there. Step forward. But uh what's what I find interesting is that he's not actually on a set path cuz sometimes he'll kind of get kind of far away and uh and then other times he gets killed immediately. All right. So I was going to skip this part originally. I wasn't was not going to include this in in the stream, I was just going to skip past this part, but I figured, you know what? Maybe, maybe people that watch this want to see what, in, what went into me picking um, the character that, that I did, I guess. I always use, I usually pick the same model uh, just because, uh, oh, where's it at? Oops, I already started, I already started off wrong. Change and lose your presets? Why, yes. I usually go with this this one right here. It's because it's almost like a... Sort of like a blank canvas in a way. Sort of. Not really. Kind of. And we just go through here and turn off the war paint. Oh, but if you're playing with the mods on... On the console. I know. Don't... Don't get me started on the PC ones. We don't have to go there. We already know, okay? You win, okay? But for the console one, and specifically for the Xbox one... They, uh, I wish they would add in, um, <clears throat> or at least that, uh, the original author for the the better Bella's better female mod. I wish somebody would uh, be like granted permission to um, use it on the Xbox. And maybe they have. I haven't looked in like the past week, so maybe it is there now. But kind of doubt it. But that'd be cool if they did. I like that one. I like that one more than the one that is currently where you can change how nice the faces look for male and females actually which is interesting okay i normally don't change too much i don't want to spend too much on this part but we will fix uh the chin width here we're going to change that and then the cheek color we're going to turn that off and the nose color we're going no color on on those parts of the the face there cheekbone width we'll go down one tick cheekbone height Another down one tick. Uh, the jaw height, we'll leave that the same. The jaw width, though, will go down two clicks. The nose length, uh, the nose nice and long. I like it. All right, okay, it works. Nose height. Uh, well, whenever, anytime you make a change to something that was already in place, it kind of affects it in kind of a dramatic way. We'll just go with that for now. The eye shape. What kind of eyes do we want? We'll just stick with these ones for now. I mean, well, I say for now, but this is going to be permanent. Yeah, I think you can change your character's face in Riften, right? Like later on, something. There's like a there's yeah. I really couldn't remember. We're going with the. Uh, gray eyes there eye width we're gonna bring that in just a bit just a tad there we go okay brow what kind of brow oh we're going for these ones yeah we're going thick we're going thick brows we want to look like every modern female nowadays uh <laughs> like how you're just like oh yeah <laughs> the mouth why the great I look angry I always find it the hardest to pick the mouth because once you change what the mouth looks like then the face starts to look different and you're like hmm hmm usually I have to I have to put hair on in order to, to actually take my focus off of it 
What are you talking about? I said thick, not thin. Did you not see the thick ones? Oh, I was talking about the thick ones. Well, that's you. You better go do that yourself. Uh. Well, I didn't hear you. I could have you said them and not thin. So it sounded like you were saying, I hate them brows. I thought you were just phrasing it weird. <laughs> Like rattle or uh, them bones, you know that song by uh, Alice Alice in Chains, you know. Which you would think, did you just say? Did you just say Alice in Chains? And it's like no, their name is Alice in Chains. Are you sure you're not saying Alice in Chains? Yes, I'm saying Alice in Chains. Are you sh anyway. Like the found some gold ore. Hell no, I didn't pick no Nord. The fuck? What's wrong with you? Skyrim belongs to the Britons. I can't decide on a hair. We're going with this one. Boom. No, we're not. <laughs> I said we're gonna go with that one, but nope. There's not very many good hairs. I'm sorry. Bethesda, please, come on. What are you doing to me, man? How am I supposed to work with this? Tell me how I'm supposed to work with this. Actually, yeah, we'll go with this one. We're going to change it to... We're going to go like... Red. Red head. Not orange, but red. There we go. Did the eyebrows change color with it? Or is it just eyebrows just... Just the same color all the time? It looks like they're the same color. We're going, we're going to go, uh, you know, we're going white instead. We're going to look like, what's her name? Fucking, uh, oh, I look stupid with the black eyebrows. All right, well, we're going this color, whatever this color is. I call it swamp brown. All right. Swamp. All right, so the chin with did we already mess? Yeah, we messed with this stuff, right? I feel like we didn't though. <laughs> All right, give those lips a little bit of color. I thought you could affect the eyes color, right? Oh yeah, there it is. Okay. I usually go for this purple color because it looks so so nice. That's a little dark, but okay. There you go. Guess you go to the darker one. Anyways. Uh I can't tell if the eyeliner is black or not. I'm gonna assume it is. Man, I'm <clears throat> heavy on the makeup, right? <laughs> Anyways. No, oh, too bad we don't have a foundation that would get rid of those wrinkles on her forehead, you know? <laughs> Anyways, there we go. Color or character is made. Finish and name your character. All right. Um, now, this is actually something interesting is that uh, I typically don't go for the comedic things. I get, like, you know, some people make some fucked up looking characters or like some silly characters. They name something silly. I usually don't do that just because... It's like, ha-ha, the joke was funny for 10 seconds. I said I usually don't do that. Ha-ha, let me, let me, uh, let me, hold on. That, that, hold on, I got cut off here. Let me, let me repeat that. Ha-ha, I usually don't do that. There we go. Now I'll edit that part in over what I was just originally saying. There we go. There we go. That's how YouTube works, right? You just, you say something wrong, and you go back and you ADR it, you know? Anyways, what are we going to name the character here? Um... Mm, mm, I'm thinking something like, uh, oh, <laughs> you know what? Yeah, here we go. We're going to name it Evie. 
like the Pokemon. Because I'll be making all kinds of transformations. All kinds. That horse, though. Oh, my God. Look at this. What up, horse? Oh, your eyes. You look so friendly. Oh, look at you. I didn't know your... Wow, your ears actually move around. Your eyes actually blink. Now, I'd be even more amazed if when you were breathing, your nostrils were moving. But obviously, they're not. All right, horse. I'll see you around, man. You take care, all right? Oh, oh. Murder his king and usurp his throne. You started this war. So, I'm not going to say anything, but whenever after Alduin starts attacking, Tolius is like, Guards, get the townspeople to say. And, like, he, if you look at the subtitles, he has a full sentence to say. But for whatever reason, it always gets cut off. Always. Never does he ever get to finish what he's saying. As you wish. Come on, I haven't thought all morning. My ancestors are smiling at me, Imperial. <laughs> the same. That his line right there just makes you think of the meme where like the meme is like a lobster about to be killed in like real life and a lobster says that. My ancestors are smiling at me, Imperial. Can you say the same? As in death, as it was in life. Next, the Breton. Next, the Breton. I play Breton. Oh, right, I didn't mention that when I was making the character. I play Breton because you get to make the uh, familiar, or you get to hex conjure a familiar. And Bretons are the only ones that start off with that ability. And I want to do full magic. I'm going. I'm going full magic. No, no swords, no bows, all magic. What, in is that? What, do you what do you see? I wonder. I mean, it's not like, you know, not like there's a big ass black dragon flying around above us. Oh, here, here get ready for here, General Tullius's line. Here it comes. There it was. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go, Rayla. Follow me. I know where we're going. I've been this way about 50 times. Where'd that horse go? Shit. I should have seen where that horse went. Legends don't burn down villages. Let's go. That dude got fucking wrecked. You know what's fucked up right here is that fucking Alduin busts in. And as soon as he busts in, this guy actually gets killed. But then Alduin's like, nah, that ain't, that ain't good enough. And he fucking torches him. Doing great. I'm still alive. Still alive, but can't apologize. Stay close to the wall. Ah! I feel like the game's a little glitchy right now. <laughs> like, normally you can see Alwyn flying around before he lands on the wall, but like. He was nowhere to be found. Typically, whenever I play this part, I like to look up at him. Or like whenever these people start shooting their spells at him. Ah! What the fuck? What the fuck just happened? Fuck. Get up. Get up. Come on, Rayloff. Let's get the fuck out of here. I don't want to be here. Any ah! 
<laughs> he knocked me over again. What the fuck? <laughs> what is going on? I've never been knocked. I've been knocked over before, but I've never been knocked over twice. <laughs> we need to get out of here, man. Holy shit, you can see his shadow cutting through the sunlight. See you later there, Rayloff. You fucking Imperial bastard. We'll meet again, Sovengard, brother. I wonder how this guy's dead. a dragon no doubt just like the children's stories and the legends the harbingers of the end times we better get moving come here let me see if i can get those bindings off get them off me there you go thank you sir as well take gunyer's gear yeah gunyer don't need this shit no more you my shit gunyer Oh, I equipped the axe. I forgot. I said magic. Okay. Go ahead and equip all the magics I got. Wait. I'm going to see if I can find some way out of here. Find this way out. But how will we get out of here, Ray? Or, I mean, what is your name? Rayloff? Oh, the other guy was Hadvar. I said, earlier I said the wrong name. Eat it! Eat the flames! Oh, I can't call him my wolfie. You cannot best me, for I have flames coming out of my motherfucking hands. All right, we're going to take all the armor uh, for the sake of selling it whenever I get to uh, Riverwood. There's actually two ways to get the key, but, uh, you know... Is that everything? Yeah. Mm, yes, it was. Alright, cool. Get a move on. Press LT to block. That's not how you block, you silly game. Let's do this, man. Ah! Surprise, motherfuckers! Oh no! I set my own dog on fire! I don't have enough magic? <laughs> This is what happens whenever you use only magic and you don't have enough. All right, good enough. Thank goodness for you, Hadvar. Wait, Rayloff. God damn, I keep getting your name mixed up. Oh well. We're taking all this shit in here. We're taking this rabbit. Taking this motherfucking pheasant. Search.
Thank you. Salt pile, sure. I might need some salt later on. Let's do this. Let's get moving. Let's get moving, sir. So I'm not going to summon the wolf this time. Oh. Oh, it's dangerous to use magic here. You might burn one of them. Oh yeah, he's like, it looks like there's something in this cage. Of course it looks like there's something in there. You can see through it. I will take your novice robes, actually. Yeah. Yes, absolutely. That's going to help me out. He's going to go ahead and do this. Oh, fuck. For the sake of uh, getting that little bit of experience towards lockpicking. Even though there's nothing in there for me to take, it still gives me that XP. Same for these ones. Boom. Uh, which one is it? Is it this one? Yeah, this is this one with the gold inside. Taking your gold skeleton. Do this, people. Orders are to wait until General Tully has arrived. I'm not waiting to be killed by a dragon. We need to pull back. Just give the general some time. Burn! You are on my side, but fire just goes everywhere. I'm sorry. I can't do anything about the fire going everywhere, man. I'm sorry. Burn! Oh. Oh, lady, don't die. Don't stand in the fire. Oh, my God. You... You people are idiots. Oh, you right in the fire, you... You fucking suck. I'm taking your great sword. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Talos guided us and shit. Talos should have guided that guy out of the fucking fire. But he didn't. Now, I'm not going to take all their armor because, uh, well, I don't have enough room for it all. Come on, this way. Let's see where this goes. Oh, I know where it goes. Rayloff. What the fuck do you do back there, Rayloff? What are you doing, man? The fuck? I'm going back, Rayloff. 
I'm going back. Oh, well, you can't go back. All right. We're staying here, Rayloff. We're staying here. No shit, it doesn't go anywhere, man. It's a dead end. Burn, baby, burn. Get off me. I know, man. I've literally been standing here for 10 seconds waiting for you to say, Hold up, there's a bear! Oh, I think we'll just go burn it. Surprise, motherfucker! Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Bear didn't stand a chance. Magic one, bear zero. We made it. We made it out. Oh my god. Wait. Wait. There he goes. Looks like he's gone for good this time. No way to know if anyone else made it out alive. But this place is going to be swarming with Imperials soon enough. Better clear out of here. My sister, Turger, runs the mill in Riverwood, just up the road. I'm sure she'd help you. Achievement out. unlocked. It's Unbound. Woo! Good luck. I wouldn't have made it without your help today. That is true, Rayloff. You would have not made it without my help. Oh man, so one so real quick, I just have to point this out. For whatever reason, this part right here, whoever was like, man, I'm going to make the rocks look more detailed. I love them. Thank you for doing that. For whatever reason, this right here, I look at it and I'm like, that looks amazing. For whatever reason. I don't know why. I can't fully explain it, but it looks amazing. You know, Rabbit! You should go to Windhelm and join Rabbit's dead as fuck now. But this pathway, when you're walking through it, and like with, you know, all the added, all the added flora that they've added, or maybe it's the fauna. Is it the flora or is it the fauna? Hmm. Maybe somebody can inform me as to which it is. But uh, it just looks so nice. See that ruin up there? I do see it, sir. Yeah. Never understood how my sister could stand living in the shadow of that place. I don't know, man. I guess you get used to it. I don't know how your sister can live in a shadow either, man. That's pretty amazing. These are the guards of the Sea Star. Three of the thirteen ancient standing stones that dot the island of Lamb. Achievement! Well, to each his own. It's not for me to judge. It's 
game's just throwing out achievements. You got it, Rayloff. I thought there was normally three wolves here. Yeah, we'll go ahead and take the wolf pelt. Okay, we're almost to... Ah, uh, destination. <laughs> I'm glad you decided to come with me. We're almost to Riverwood. Well, you see, Rayloff, I'm more of a, a crip than a blood, so, you know. That's a joke, people. It's a joke. I'm just kidding. Now, is it? She's probably working in her lumber mill. I want to know what Girder was working on, though, because, like, when you see her, she's like hammer on shit. Oh, actually, no, she's not even hammering this time. She's just standing here. She's just resting. Mercy, good to see you. But is it safe for you to be here? Gerder. I heard that Ulfric had been captured. Gerder, I'm fine. At least now I am. Are you hurt? What's happened? And who is this? One of your comrades? Not a comrade yet, but a friend. I owe her my life, in fact. Yeah, you do. You wouldn't have made it out of Helgen alive if it wasn't for me. In these amazing hands. These hands. Hey guys, I remind you that these hands are what saved you. These hands right here. Yeah, these ones. What's going on? You two look pretty well done in. <sighs> I can't remember when I last slept. Oh, where's the fun? Well, the news you heard about Ulfric was true. The Imperials ambushed us outside Darkwater Crossing. Like they knew exactly where we'd be. That was... Uh, two days ago now. We stopped in Helgen this morning, and I thought it was all over. Had us lined up to the headsman's block and ready to start chopping. The cowards. They wouldn't dare give Ulfric a fair trial. Treason for fighting for your own people. All of Skyrim would have seen the truth then. <laughs> but then, out of nowhere... Are you just now getting there? Dragon attack. You don't mean a real, live... Oh, yeah. Hardly believe it myself. And 
I was there. As strange as it sounds, we would be dead if not for that dragon. If not for the dragon. He managed to slip away. Are we really the first to make it to Riverwood? Nobody else has come up the south road today, as far as I know. Good. Maybe we can lay up for a while. I hate to put your family in danger, Gabriel, but... But... I always like... I hate to put your family in danger, but... I'm going to, because you're going to let me stay at your place. Any friend of Raylos is a friend of mine. Here's the key to the house. Stay as long as you like. Thanks, Gerda. Just let me know. Uh, give me this amethyst. I'll take this carrot. And what's up, Doc? And the lockpick. Potion of minor healing. Uh, of course. There is something you could do for me. For all of us here. The Jarl needs to know if there's a dragon on the loose. Riverwood is defenseless. We need to get word to Jarl Ball. Jarl Ball. To we gotta, gotta get world to word to Jarl Ball. Do that for me. I'll be in your debt. Thanks, sister. I knew we could count on you. Yeah. I knew we could count on you, too. I didn't know you before, but I knew we could count on you. All right, let's go. Yeah, they're still having a whole conversation behind me. I'm like, I'm out, motherfuckers. The world is my oyster. Or if you if you will, my cloister. Ha <laughs> ha, get it? Because cloister, you know, he's he's Pokemon. Okay, anyway. Um, all right. All right, let's talk to the old Fane Doll here. Was agreeable enough, I suppose. He's a bard, so he says. Nothing wrong with bards. And sonnets are going to convince Camilla Valerius to marry him. An intelligent, beautiful woman like her wouldn't fall for that nonsense. I hope. You hope. You don't sound very sure. Maybe Camilla needs a little help seeing Sven for what he is. Could you, could you give her this letter and say it's from Sven? I think I've matched that Nord's lack of cleverness perfectly. I could do that. I could be I could be a shitty person and lie to this woman that I don't know. I like how Skyrim gives you the, like these moral decisions and you don't realize that they're moral decisions. You're just like, "Oh yeah, you want you want to fake fake a letter so that you can get with this girl? I, man, I'll help you out." And then Whenever you go talk to the other guy, he said he basically does the exact same thing. So like they're both shitty people. So it's like, which one do you want to pick? The first shitty guy you talk to, or the second shitty guy? Feindal thinks he can woo Camilla Valerius. <sighs> what is this? The elf playing at treachery? Shocking. Oh yeah, I'm the one who told you about that stuff. Dribble. How about we play a bit of a turnabout? <laughs> I like how you're naming off the stuff you get for picking Feindal, and I'm just like, I know. I told you. <laughs> uh-huh. All right, Sven. Orgnar. Ale's going bad. Orgnar, are you listening to me? Yep. So you don't have potatoes in your ears after all. <laughs> well, one of us has to do something. Hey, Camilla Valerius, here you go. What are you talking about? What's in the letter? What's in the letter? Oh my. He he wanted me to think Fandal wrote this? Thank you for telling me the truth. You're welcome, lady. I'm sure he'll want to thank you for standing up for him. Maybe. Riverwood trade. Uh, did yeah, something happen? We did have a bit of a this dude looks like I think I've mentioned I think I mentioned this when I played the game on 360. But he looks like someone I actually know in real life. It's weird. You could? Yeah, I'll, I'll go get that back for you. No, Camilla Valerius, you don't have to escort me. I hate that. She's like, I'll take you to the end of town. It's like no, you you really don't need to do that. It's cool. Oh, and then like she's still gonna go anyway. There she is. Run! There. 
Everything's so peaceful. Oh, look at these rocks. Look at these rocks, man. Look at those rocks. Look at this pathway right here. This looks amazing. Look at it. Some rocks, though. Okay. Bring it on, doggo. Your move. Oh, I didn't even tell Fane Doll that, like. Oh well. What's funny is like they don't ever get together. Like that's where it ends. That's just it. Oh shit! I was supposed to sell all my stuff. I need to go do that before it's too late to apologize for not selling the stuff, and then I don't have enough room to get it. Sorry, if you thought I was making a reference to a song, you're wrong. I wasn't. I wasn't doing that. Yes, I was. Papa gave me his money on Friday. Ain't every day we get visitors and hmm, blades, helmets. I did. Pretty much anything to suit your needs. Yeah, give me all your gold. The reason why I kept the great sword is I'm thinking about using it. <laughs> I never use heavy weapons in this in this game and so so I was thinking about using it be like a uh, it's kind of a night like an interesting trade-off think about it so if I wanted to do like some heavy damage I have to switch to the heavy weapon okay but if I want to deal out you know my magic then I have to switch to that so it's kind of a interesting trade-off like to have to go back and forth I could add challenge Eh, I don't know. Isn't it usually like really windy up here? Like, oh, okay, there it goes. Never mind. Could have swore like the fogginess started further back, but I guess I was wrong. Ah, oh, I love how this game looks. Now, didn't really like how it looks back then when it first came out. Oh, is it really a surprise? I don't think it's a surprise that you got fucking wrecked. Surprise, motherfucker! That bow ain't gonna save you? Uh-oh. Whoa. Nope, you can't see me. No, you can't see me. You're cheating. You can't see me! You're cheating! You can't see me! Ah! Oh, no! You won't show me nothing. I don't want to see it. Oh. No, leave me alone. Leave me alone. Eat it. Eat it. Aha! I win this one. Uh oh. What do you got for me? Taking all this shit. Alright, alright. Let's drink a potion. That should be enough to kill her, right? Take that! Fucking got him.
Coin purse, sweet. All right. Did I check this? No, I didn't actually. Bleak Falls Barrow. Alright. Normally I would kill all these people and then take their armor and then go sell it. I don't think I'm going to do that. It takes a while to do that. Actually, I might. <laughs> I say that. But I might do it now. Cooked beef. I'll take that. Make a hamburger. Back off. Oh, I got some fancy footwork too. I almost fell off. Screw you, lady. Serpentine. Oh, well, he hit me. Aha! You missed me. Uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna go kill these, uh... These peoples inside of here. And then I'll, I'll return back to Riverwood. All right, so last time I was streaming, this is where uh, I did um, leave off. Because then that's whenever I started having super fucking terrible inter internet troubles. I mean, the worst. And uh, it was so bad that it was like that for a month, maybe? Maybe? No. Well, yeah, I don't know. It was pretty bad. Anyways, and it turns out that the whole fucking, like, district that the internet company has over here was just like uh the fucking lines are fucked up and they had to go and repair repair and repair the lines and uh that took that took a, a couple of days to do I think I am going to sell. I'll go sell some of this stuff. Show me this stoof. Stoofish. Okay. God damn. I was going to say, is it really all the way over? Can't be. Can't be. All that for some gold and some lockpicks. Nice. Oh, hey. I forgot this stuff was actually on the ground. Take this stuff. All right. Is it there? I th oh, there, there he is. That's the man I'm looking for. This guy right here. Don't worry, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna take the long way down. I am going this way. Oh, I guess we could have went over. There we go.
hopefully, the guy didn't close down shop yet, but he may have. I hope not. He probably did stop selling. <laughs> oh, is he there? I don't see anything. And no. All right. Well, time to go stay at the old inn for a bit. Oh, right. -a. Not me. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Thanks, Delphine. Word is Ulfric Stormcloak escaped from the Imperials. War is only going to get worse now. All right. Ever the uh, you don't get optimistic one, aren't you? Oh wait, is this the one I'm sleeping in? No. Uh, this one? No. Maybe this one? There we go. Let's sleep. Let us sleep. I think, uh, 12 hours of rest is good, right? One. Two. Three. Four. Five, six, seven, eight. Give me a mug of ale. All right, I'm out. See you guys later. Whatever you need. That's the guy I'm waiting for too. He was busy drinking. He must have passed out here. Cause when I mean, I mean, I came out of my room. Oh shit! The fuck, dude. Damn. It's like he didn't even go home last night. He stayed at the inn the whole night. Now I gotta wait for him to walk over here. Oh my god. Now he's talking to the chicken. The fuck? So, I don't know what it is. But, apparently, I mean, when I play Skyrim, my internet's like, Oh, you're playing Skyrim? Let's fuck up on you. Yeah. Now let's do that. Because I look over and it's like dropping frames, dropping frames. I'm like, this is fucking lame. It's only a few frames every now and then, but it's enough to make me think, motherfucker, why do you do this to me? Yeah. All right. What have you got for sale, sir? Pretty much anything to suit your needs. Is that so, sir? All right. We're going to sell you the shield. The fur armor. Yes. Yes. Actually, should I wear fur armor? I should wear it, right? So I can take a little more hits. Like, I am a mage. But, I mean, there's nothing wrong with wearing some light armor. Hide armor, we'll give it. Well, if that was the case, then I guess I oh, should have wore hide armor, right? Oh well. Oh well. We're just selling it for the moolah anyway. Oh, look at that. Uh, hmm. One. Um, hmm. <laughs> Ah, see, I kind of, there's a part of me that's like, hey, why don't you, instead of, you know, you know what, no, 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 all right, I was going to use uh, some stuff that uh, Good day. I normally don't like heavy armor, or the iron armor, rather, and then I thought, nah, nah.
Oh, I came here to sell. We got need a room, drink for the thirsty, food for the hungry. Is that so? Okay. Well, I can only sell some things. Just fine. Uh, carrot. Sell the carrot. Just keep the cooked beef. Sell the garlic. Oh, this is all the stuff I stole from Helgen. Take all this. Except for the skeever tails. All right. Okay, so because I keep dropping frames, it's about a hundred. Is yeah, about a hundred every time it does happen. It's not every second or anything like that. Whatever you need, buy each near if it's. Oh, no, it's not a hundred. Why did I say a hundred? I don't know. But anyways, uh, I think I'm gonna stop the stream for now, and then start it back up. So, uh, yeah. So this is, I guess, this is part one, if you will. Um, but anyway, yeah, I I shall return. But I hope you're having a good day or night. Depending on when you watch this, and as always, thanks for watching.